Hey there, my name is Lori. The world is a crazy place right now and I thought I was going to straighten my hair and I thought maybe you might want to sit there and watch me or maybe straighten your hair with me. But let's just hang out for a bit. <laughs> uh, I'll show you what I'm going to use. So the first thing is my heat protector. Even if you think you're using it on low heat, you need a heat protector. So. <clears throat> um, this one that I use is the Davenis Oi All-in-One Milk and it's really nice because it works for all hair types. It's very, very light. I have a lot of hair and this does not weigh it down, which is great. So, and if you have fine hair, it's nice because just a couple little spritzes and it gets its way through there. Um, and yeah, it's a thermal protectant. So it also controls frizz and it is um, a detangler as well. So that's helpful. And it adds shine and softness, which I can for sure tell you it's true. And silkiness, um, it gives body without weighing it down, which I already said, it moisturizes the hair. Uh, it is perfect for blow drying and uh, of course the heat protection which is the whole reason why I use it um longer lasting hairstyle and then it just tells you how to use it but I'll tell you how to use it so anyways if you're still watching after that let's move on <laughs> uh, this is the hair straightener that I'm going to be using it is from Lange I believe that's how you say it Lange uh it is the Le Rev. It is amazing. So why I love this so much is, it's not on right now, but down here it has infrared light, which helps to seal sort of the cuticle of the hair, which is essentially what you want. The smoother the cuticle, the smoother the hair. So I'm gonna turn it on, I have it already plugged in. We'll see how fast um, it takes. So it's going to go up to, sorry, my, my puppy is wanting attention. What are you doing? He's insane. <laughs> uh, so if you can see, it's like going to go up to 300. So it's getting up there quick. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I have it at 450, which is as high as it goes. And because my hair is curly and whatever I I really like that high heat so if you don't want to have it that high you definitely don't have to have it that high I think when I used this on my niece's hair I had it at like four no not even four I had it at like 350 maybe and the first thing you want to do is you want to brush your hair now because this is a detangler i am going to spray it in before i brush and you want to make sure you get like each sort of layer of the hair so you want to make sure you get the underside of it drop a bit more and then there we go all right then brush now I love this brush I cannot tell you enough how much I love this brush I'll show it to you in a second So, this is Ted. Ted is my Pomeranian cross Shih Tzu puppy. He is the cutest. Oh. Okay, so now that it's brushed, you just want to make sure that you kind of feel that the um, uh, 
milk has sort of touched every part of your hair. And then you're gonna let it dry off for a sec because you never wanna touch your hair when it's wet with a hot tool. So that's when you'll hear <laughs> Okay, so the next thing you wanna do is you wanna section your hair. Sectioning your hair, you guys, it's so important. It makes it so much easier and you're in much more control of what you're doing. So, who doesn't like to be in control, right? I mean, come on. So, I basically put up a little over half of my hair. What do you need? Of course he wants attention right now. You're fine, baby boy. All right, so. What I'm going to do is take a little section like this, like an inch or so, and go slowly. Okay, so I'm going to take another inch or so, and you want to get as close to your scalp as you can get, and then... Come down. Ted, you're fine, buddy. And then, we got probably one more section here. I'm really sorry about that. That was Ted. He uh, hit the little table that my camera's on. Said you all for a ride. Um, okay. I did not get close enough to my scalp. It's really hard. Like I'm looking in my my uh, camera, and it's like making me scared to get too close. It's so funny. But okay, so a few things, <laughs> a few reasons why I love Lange uh, La Rev here is because. Of the titanium plates I find that titanium really spreads the heat out evenly so that each individual hair is being touched with the same heat so they'll all essentially look the same and then with the oh, I guess I can show you now the infrared lights It's so hard to show you. But anyways, there's these little red lights in there. And I honestly have never felt my hair as soft and sleek as I have after using this hair straightener. So if you are looking for a new hair straightener, I highly suggest this one. Now I actually would like to, to have their Le Gloss. Their Le Gloss, it's exactly the same, however, it is um, a wider plate. So it's like, like this or whatever, it's basically double this. And I really like that just because I have so much hair. So I honestly think that it would it would cut my time down. That was a large section. I shouldn't have done it that large. But I'm just gonna go slow. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I actually haven't straightened my hair in so long. Well, I shouldn't say that. I straightened it like once, but very quickly a few weeks ago. Okay, so the slower you go, the sleeker it looks. You want to 
brushes through. And then even with like that bottom stuff that you've already done, I like to do it sort of all together. Ooh. <laughs> My tummy just growled. It's lunchtime. <laughs> Okay, one more section here. Now, these front sections, you'll go over multiple times just because you want to, look at that. Let's just, let's just take a second here. <laughs> what do you think? Okay, this is this is why I straightened my hair. So it's nice and sleek like this. <laughs> okay. Let's do it up. I don't know if I told you why I love that brush so much, but I love it because it's flexible. Can you see that? It's, um, it does not get tangled on my hair, and that is unusual because my hair is so curly, naturally. It, it never actually wants to, like, be touched by a brush. So, do, 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 do. let's take a little section. Ooh, it is so weird. Looking at it through here. Let's go one more here. And then there's, see these like little strips here? Don't get me wrong, it's like it's not cold by any means. However, it's not bad. You can you can use your fingers to touch there. Okay, let's move on. Okay, so I could just do here, but I'm gonna brush my where where my bangs would be if I had bangs. And I'm gonna save these for the end. Okay. That's why I love these jaw clips so much too because like that's a little bit of hair and it's got it secured and it can also hold all of my hair so there's that. Now if you don't have as much hair as me you don't have to do as many sections as I do and that means you're lucky. <laughs> like if you're following along right now there's a good chance a lot of you will already be done or waiting for me to do <laughs> this front part here okay Oh, it's these. I'm like, what? Why is that not doing that? I get it. I get ya. Yeah. I'll have to get the rest of that when I do the bang part. Okay. It's so cool with all the colors, eh? I just, I love it. My stylist is amazing. She uses a color called, 
like a color line from Goldwell and it's called Illumin. If you know what Illumin is, give the video a thumbs up. <laughs> Illumin represent. It's all these vibrant colors. They also have uh, neutral colors as well though. But they are permanent. <laughs> If you ever, if you ever want to go with a Vivid and you want to get it done at a salon, ask, ask them if they do a Lumen. I love this part. It's like, it's like a sunset. Oh, it feels so soft, you guys. So soft. Did you see that? I just about brushed my eye. <laughs> Random. Okay. Good for now. All right. So here's the kicker. I like to brush them and then I don't look in the mirror or in the camera or anything when I do this. I go by feel. Because I find when I go by feel, I can get closer <laughs> to the skin. Okay. And I just give it a slight little twist at the bottom, see? And then I can bring all of it around. Do, do, do. Now the one thing, if you're ever thinking about getting the, like, the middle part, like this, you want to make sure you have a proper comb so you can go right down the middle because it is not easy. So right now I don't have my little rat tail comb with me. So what I am going to do is I'm just going to do a little side part like, just like this. And then because this is how I want to keep it. Now I can go through and I'm just going to slightly twist it. See that? It comes away from my head a little bit. Almost done guys. Almost done. I'm just going to twist it just a little bit. And use my brush. There we go. Just like that. I could actually tuck it behind if I wanted to. Like that. And then this side, just because I want it to all sort of flow together, this, this side is fine. I'll tuck that back there. Just this little section, and I'm just going to twist it a little bit towards the end there. it a little too hard <laughs> but that's fine I can just twist that all back there and then you just want to look at it 
And if it feels like it's thick anywhere, you can always go through. And I think that's good. Well, thank you so much for joining me. I hope that you have a fabulous day. If you want to see more videos, click that subscribe button. This is the start of my beauty week. So two more videos this week of beauty. Uh, yeah, I will see you on the flip side.